slow sips, Halfton. It helps the brew stay down. Soothing herbs lift the fog from my mind for a time. How long has she been mixing these for you? You're stalling, Eivor. Tell me what you've learned, what news from the north. The Picts were beaten back. We took their lives and their treasures. Father had asked me to deliver this. Is he taunting me? me? These goblets are a cruel joke. He is mocking me. We did capture some barrels of Frankish Black. He said they were for you, but I made him open a cask. We drank together. There was no poison. Speak without guise, Eivor. Does he plot against me or no? Does he keep secrets? Give me something I can use. Now you must choose between treason and madness. Between the serpent's fang and the bite of a rabbit wolf. Faravid asks for my silence, but Hafton expects the truth. If I'm not careful, these lies will pile up, one upon the next. You have grown awfully silent, Wolfkist. Part of it has planned an attack on the Picts at Markness. Without you. That twin-faced, backstabbing glory eater! When? Tell me. I won't know until we meet at a place called the Walls. Good. Go to him. What? Listen. Unearth his lies. You will find them. If you fear poison, Lord, you must consider everything, even Moira's brew. Impossible. Moira has been with me for an age. She is no witch. She is kind. And... <sighs> Perhaps you can speak with her and find out for yourself. She stays within Donacaster, not far from here. If you learn something, find me north of Donacaster. One of my scouts there has troubling news. Going for a walk. I should see more about this brew she's been feeding Afton.
how this works? Fix a problem or two for us? You... Come back and... What do you see, Suna? Is not here. This letter came from Wika. She must have gone there. We should go to Wika. Find Moira. Small village. Moira's house must be near. Out of there, you heathen lover! What is this ruckus? Stand back, Dane. There's a witch within that house. We've come to burn it down. She's no witch. She's Hafton's healer. That proves it. Dark magic, that is. Clear out, all of you, before I beat you senseless. Now, leave this woman alone. Even look her way again, and it'll be the last thing you see, Moira. We'll be safe here. Thank you, Eivor. A thousand times, I thank you. And if I asked you to drink your own brew? I would, gladly, and often do from time to time. To ensure it's not overly bitter before serving to Hafton. When you said there's no cure for what ails Hafton, you mean his touch in the head? I fear so. The same malady bedeviled my mother. The body breaks down and the mind falls apart over time. It's a terrible thing. Can you cure his illness with such a brew? My medicine is meant to alleviate his pain, not cure it. I fear there is no cure at all for what ails Hafton. I should return to Hafton. He said he would be at the Temple of Flora. Tread lightly this topic with him, if you would tread it at all.
Afton, good to find you here. Fida returns. I keep quiet. I'm hunting a band of traitors lurking about this swamp. Who told you there are traitors here? My scout. He asked me to join him here, but he is nowhere to be found. Have a look around. Tell me if you see something. Eivor, search the perches and lookouts here. We could be spying from above. Olav! Cast about this land, my friend. He's clinging to life. I should carry him down. I found your scout, but his wounds are grave. Olaf. Poor Olaf. He will be buried with honors. I will see to that. Walk the bridge, old friend. I will see you on the other side. Be <coughs> Anton may track his attackers. Get them, boy! <coughs> Good boy! Follow their trail! the ground with their blood! Who are these men you suspect of treason? Thieves who stole my war spoils. Looks abandoned. The trail ends, but nobody's here. Here, a hidden entrance. It might be lurking below. These pipes burst. Even this old Roman work cannot withstand the icy kiss of Winter's goddess. Look there. The pipes cut through that wall. Could there be more rooms beyond? Something is there. Hold on, we'll find a way through. You must hurry.
The Romans were fine craftsmen. These chambers are vast and decorated, and laced with piping. Yet they went mad and vanished, just like their gods. Moira's books tell us so. Ah, here, you see? Spoils of war. Mine from me! I am beset on all sides, Eivor, by plotters and schemers. What kings and jarls are not? Your territory is vast and wealthy. Every day, decisions I make change the lives of thousands. It is a burden fair. Yet I do. I do. You spoke with Moira. What did you learn? She means well. I don't believe she would poison you, Lee. She also said she had your illness before, in her own family. Said it came on slow, but was incurable. No. No, this is not an illness. This is poison. Somehow someone is poisoning me. Shh. Listen. These will be the thieves who stole my tribute. And half done. Well met. Come, fill your bellies with meat. You stole this tribute. By rights, this is mine. It was meant for me. Stole oh, nothing. Faravid gifted this to us for a hard day's battle. And did you take my scout Olaf in that battle? Your brother in arms? You have to die for this tribute? That was. That was Olaf? Damned fool! We thought he was a thief! The only thieves here are the ones drinking my mead and spit-shining my silver! You! Cowards and traitors! We are owed this bounty, Jarl. For battles won and blood let. Eivor, you tell him! This is treason, and treason is punishable by death. Faravid treated us better than you ever did. Faravid is nothing, and you are less. Forced my hand. Take hold of your fear, Hafton. It can poison your mind. Faravid killed this man, not me. He forced my hand with slights and trickery. He. <coughs> Forgive me. I find it hot in these furs. The day must be warming. You have a meeting with Faravid, is that not right? I do, at the waltz. Yes, I know the place well. It is on the road between Jorvik and Vicharinga. Press him, Eivor, as hard as you can. Never let up, and bring me proof of his treachery, or otherwise. Traitors, thieves. No right, they had no right to... It's rightfully mine.
Survey the area, Sunan. Eivor, welcome. Join me in drowning this golden drink. You made it. Come, have a drink. You're a few horns deep already. <laughs> Yet still floating. Tell me, how did my old friend like his goblet gift? There were other things on his mind. Your man Ulfra, for instance. He died protecting the spoils he stole from Hafton. Ulfra. Poor Ulfra. I told him to mind your tongue, but he... Hafton always so easily riled. No. Riches and glory have shaped him into something new. He is not the same man he used to be. What is this? I expected an army. For Warcraft. This was our. F I came here with Hafton and his brothers, Uba and Ivar. We besieged Jorvik and put King Alla in the cold ground. Those were good days, now too far gone. What is all this? My share of the treasure we took from those distant days. I buried it here for a rainy day. This bag is heavy with silver. Enough to pay for an army. Me to Jorvik, Eivor. Remind me of the glories long gone. You're drunk to win a race. Then have a drink. Make it fair. New friend, Eivor. Waiting for spring. Best not fall off your words. See you in Yorick.
Okay. Having trouble keeping up. My horse must be deeper in the cups than I am. What are we doing in Yorwick? You haven't said. Paying a visit to our kept King Rishi. Long may he reign. I haven't enough men to beat the Picts alone, but with Rishi and his feared, we'll finish them off. You'd bring a puppet king into this fight, but not your Yol? Psh! Keep this to yourself. The streets have ears, the windows have eyes. I did not agree to this level of deception. Fix. You should have told me this before. Eivor, my friend. If I describe my full strategy, we might never leave the campfire. I'd prefer the light of a fire to the darkness of your plans. Don't do it again. Uh -huh. Well, my price is the... Yes, all right. No, sure. I have customers for this. Anything else? I must be on my way now. I've been afraid to touch even a drop of wine since the Yuletide feast. One more reason to stick with Anne. I wish Yuletide happened every month. The daily slog kills me. Wait. A favor I must ask of you. Make no mention that Hafton is ignorant of our plans. It's better this way. Are you mad? Rishia answers to Hafton. You put this man in grave danger if he defies his master's will. Rishia cannot defy orders he has never heard, no? Trust me. I will take the blame should our plan fall apart. Eivor the wolf kissed and half done's cupbearer. What a curious surprise. I hope the day finds you and Jorvik well. Yes, we scrape by, with what little we still own. But this new war should make us wealthy once again, until our tribute is taken. I smell the bile on your breath, King. Do not forget who is in charge here. Oh, do remind me, Faravid. Yesterday it was half done. But today, I hear whispers that you are leading the charge. I am confused. Yes, you answer to Hafton. And now, he orders one final strike on the picked stronghold at Magnus. To make war with the North on such a scale will require a hefty amount of silver and a large force of men. My soldiers and silver are pledged already. I expect the same from you. I've given my aid as well. The battle must be decisive. 
I see. And you have these orders from Halfdan in writing, yes? From the great man himself? Not with us, but you can rest assured Hafton has need of you. He expects a swift victory. I'm sorry, Faravid, but duty compels me to refuse. Without strict orders from Hafton, I will not risk the lives of so many. You deny me! I do. To gift you an army puts my wealth and reputation at risk. That's not what Hafton wants. He needs a strong and loyal king. You presume to know what Hafton wants. Hearsay is not enough. For all I know, this is another of Hafton's tests. The greatest snake in Northumbria, that Saxon is. But we need his army to take Magnus. And we'll have it. If we fortify orders from Hafton ourselves. You would do this? Draw up fake orders and pass them off as real? That's it. And I know just who to speak with. Hjor of Jorvik. He'll know what we need. Good. Hjor's favorite alehouse is nearby. Seek him there. <laughs> 